is the spirit who weakens. It 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 is the spirit who weakens. Every seed that you've been sowing that has taken long to germinate. Every seed that you've been planting. Financial seeds. Tithes, offerings. Words, prayer, fasting. Reading the word of God. Helping others. Every seed that you've planted. Educating children who are not yours. Taking care of people who are not yours. Being kind and merciful to people. God is going to reward you for those seeds. Amen. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the realm of the spirit, I see men and women in dark clothes in front of this army. And I see this fellowship running from behind at another speed that is higher than theirs. And I see you people overtaking these men. And in the name of the Spirit, I heard God tell me that speak to them and say that the ones that I'm putting on dark clothes are the children of the wicked one. They are the men who belong to the wicked kingdom. So they are living in a season where I'm causing a transfer of positions from the wicked ones to the righteous ones. Yeah. Says the Spirit of God. Yeah. The Spirit of God says to you that within 23 days from now, some of you are going to have an experience of unusual miracles. Yeah. Being promoted, being promoted three steps ahead in 23 days from now. Yeah. Getting abnormal jobs that you never applied for in 23 yeah. days from now. Because the spirit weakens. And in the realm of the spirit, I saw us running so fast. And yet these people were using horsepower. They were on horses. And I saw us running and overtaking them. And yet they were using chariots. And the spirit of God whispered to me to minister to you. That they are trusting the power of chariots. And yet for you trusting my power, says the spirit. And the spirit of God says to you, between now and the 31st of December, says the Holy Ghost, I shall cause a quickening of my spirit that shall cause you to overtake those that have been ahead of you, says the Spirit of God. And therefore, the Spirit of God says to you, you are living in a time where I'm repositioning you on the doorsteps of 2016. That I shall cause a miracle that I've not been witnessing in this country to be real in this ministry, says the Spirit of God. The Spirit of God says to you, that this shall become like a center of healing. You will see people with sicknesses that doctors have failed to detect being healed from this place. Amen. Says the Spirit of God. Amen. The Spirit of God says, you're living in an hour where I will cause the media, the journalists to come in this place to get faster information that they shall, that they shall document in the papers for the following day. Amen. Says the Spirit of God. Amen. The Spirit of God says to you, for you are living in a time where I'm sitting with the burning candle. For I'm looking for every person in this place, and they shall be used as great men and women. Yeah. For God says to you, you are living a season, you are living a time, you are living a place where some of you have been great people, some of you have been nobodies. God says, I'm causing the nobodies to become great men and women. Yeah. As I spoke to you in the beginning of this year, says the Lord. God says, yes, I have had a cry of most of you. I've had a cry of most of you in the area of finances, in the area of marriage, and God says, yet I shall cause many of you, the season that is coming between March and September of 2016, to be ushered into holy matrimony, Amen. says the Spirit of God. And the Spirit of God says to you, it is not going to be as a result of too much prayer, but I shall cause men and women to come to you, and they'll ask you, when are you getting married? You'll have no answers because you don't have spouses. It shall come to pass that at the very moment when you start, men and women will come your way and they will propose and they will say, I've seen the wife in you, I've seen the husband in you. Says the Spirit of God. Says the Spirit of God. God says, At this Zion, there is life. At this mountain Zion, there is no love. At this mountain Zion, 
They are millionaires in making, says the Spirit of God. And let the Spirit of God say to you, between March and September in that very season, many of you will start companies that will explode because they will be funded by people you do not know, says the Spirit. The Spirit of God says that is the time when most of you will even visit your bank accounts. And people will call and say, this is your account. I'll put their money. Go to Western Union. And people that you even befriended through friends will know you and fund your projects. People that you never expected to give you a helping hand. I will cause my spirit to minister to them. And they will come and minister to you with their substance. Says the Spirit of God. Amen. And for the first time during that time, most of you as you minister, the congregation will be saying, I saw angels ministering with you. Amen. I will send my angels in the congregation. That as they are ministering, the angels will also be ministering. Amen. As they are preaching, the angels will also be preaching. Amen. As you are worshiping me truth and spirit, Amen. the angels will join you and also be worshiping with you, Amen. says the spirit. Amen. And during that time it shall come to pass that I spoke through the prophet John, that I will pour out my spirit upon all flesh. And not only that, it is when I say it, that I will saw signs and wonders about the heavens, blood and fire and smoke. You will be in services where people will see fire, Amen. physical fire is setting down, and burning diseases that doctors cannot treat. Says the Spirit. Says the Spirit. Someone begin to speak to God. Let us come. Sometimes I pray for you next time you'll come back with it with a testament. In the name of Jesus, I command you to be free from that infirmity. In Jesus' name. Pastor, she believes God to be healed from cancer. She has breast cancer. Be healed. I command that spirit to come out of you right now. Come out. 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 Come out of this woman. Out in Jesus' name. Come out. 